All right, we are here with the Raider, the Vanguard for the Viking class. As you can see, he starts off with Rush, trigger to gain movement speed for short duration. March for death, you reveal the target's position and lower their attack and defense. Second win, you recover some of your health. And then you have a Fire Flask, which basically is an incendiary grenade. So um, I haven't tried out many of his abilities. You really don't need to. Uh, this is a character who is not only fun to play and good defense, good trolling, well, not good trolling, but good defense, good attacking. But he is the troll character. He has a thing. His unblockable is, like, if you are running at him, kind of like the Warlord from the last episode. But if you're running at them and you hold down X, you can charge into him. Now, the Warlord, he put his shield into him and just pushed them back. Stunned them. The enemies can hit them during this time. Or you can hit them during this time. But the, the Raider, he straight up unblockable picks them up and puts them on his shoulder. And then you run for a little bit, and at the very end of it, you throw them. So you can literally come out of nowhere, pick someone up, run to the edge of a cliff, and just toss them off. I'm going to see about doing it, <laughs> if I can, and show you guys. I don't think I can here. Uh, probably won't be able to here. Actually, I will. I just need to go up this ladder. And hope to God that they're in the right position. <laughs> I'll see. I'll see if I can't show it off for you guys. I might actually hurt my KDR, not KDR, but I might actually hurt the uh, idea of me being on top of eliminations again to do this. But it'll be worth it if I can get it off. Oh my God! My own fucking teammate is hitting me, and it's pissing me off. You lost zone a. Just fucking break their goddamn neck. So good. Another thing is, you can tell by the long axe that he's using. Just flat out. You can just mow down fucking enemies. Another thing is by holding down both uh, light and heavy attack, he does a really good unblockable swing that can do a lot of damage. Increase my sprint speed for a short time. That's where he can't get away. And kill him. Oh, I tried to break his guard right as he was attacking, and that's a guaranteed hit for them, basically. I do want to try the troll, the troll technique. I'm definitely not on top. Actually, I'm tied for top. <laughs> but, oh, I was revived. Hell yes. Yeah, we're going to come up here, and we're going to see about maybe trolling. No, nope, they're not anywhere near where we need to be. <laughs> Yes. I love that. I just love that attack. <laughs> you just You put the emphasis on the wrong syllable. <laughs>
That's my kill. I earned it. <laughs> okay, they have C right now. I'm gonna see if I can't bait out the trolling tactic. Nope. I'm capturing it. I might stay up here for a little while. I'm definitely not winning on uh, takedowns, but I do have the highest score. So I think I might just chill up here until I can bait out the trolling technique. Because I do want to show you guys, because it is so fucking funny. Oh, I'm not going to be able to now. That's upsetting. Wait, nope. Here comes somebody. What the? God damn you. So I wasn't able to do it because my own fucking teammate hit me and she dodged, so. Oh well. Either way, you do have to get in a straight line because you can't turn while doing theirs either. But, as you can see, as long as you have that mentality, the brute mentality, where you can just fucking go to town on people as a Viking, it is really fun. Okay, let's see if I can't bait him out this time. Maybe? Nope. He went all the way out there. Yeah, I'll never get... Yep, he's done. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Oh, well. We still got victory. Uh, I definitely didn't get most kills. I got second most kills. Um, only had one death, but I did have the most objective time. And, you know, there are multiple ways to play this. If you want to just go around killing people, that's one thing. If you want to play the objective, that's one thing, too. You know, it works both ways. But either way, the Raider's a really fun character. He's got reach on his side. He's got great damage. His power attacks are fantastic. Um, his unblockable does take a lot of stamina, uh, I'm pretty sure he might have another unblockable that I don't know about, but either way, as you can see, uh, his throws were his main thing. You know, you could guard break them, throw them into a wall, and you saw I pinned him up and then kneed him in the face. In an actual PvP match, I'm not sure how it would affect the AI, but in an actual PvP match, you know, that makes them dazed. So, like, they can't see their reticle anymore, they can't see your reticle, so they don't know which way you're attacking from. The screen's a little bit brighter, it's really disorienting. So, uh, they're a really fun character, and I highly recommend you try them out, because all the Viking classes, so far every class in this game is super fun, but the Viking classes, there's just something about being a fucking brute, and just going in and dominating that is just awesome. <laughs> just flat out awesome. But um, that's all for the Vikings of this beta. Unfortunately, like I've said in multiple videos, the Valkyrie is not available. Um, for the Samurais, the Shugoki is not available. And for the Knights, the Lawbringer is not available. But we are going to be starting to tackle the Knights next. And we will be going after the Peacekeeper. The Dual Wield Knight. See you all then.